What's up YouTube? This is Victor on the Let Me Explain show and today I'm going to do a review on um, living the field, um, tapping into the secret force of the universe. And this is um, an audio book by Lynn McTaggart and um, basically he talks about harnessing the source of living energy, the zero point field. Now I've been listening to this um, um, audio book for, for a while and it's interesting how how um, much information is out there that's not publicly available like um, even taught in schools um, some of this stuff is really transformational when it comes to the way we look at the world and uh, the way we interact with the world so what I love about this this um, audiobook is that Lynn McTaggart the author is, um, is an award-winning journalist who put a lot of research into this product um, traveling the world and talking to scientists, working with scientists and um, she's also the author of um, The Intention Experiment which is a book you might like to look into because it has some fascinating um, information about um, energy and the way we interact with the world around us. So I'll just go through the the CDs and give you some some um, information about what's contained in it because there's quite a lot so I'm going to be reading through these. The first session is titled The Science Behind the Field and in this you get uh, beyond um, our outmoded paradigms and she's talking about the belief systems we have around um, energy and so on and then there's connectivity in the session we're all connected uh, unfinished reality which is something you might want to to listen to the ever present here in other words the the whole idea of time and space um, a, f a fundamental shift extending our human abilities and this first disc has a total running time of 44 minutes so there's a it's packed with information in under an hour the sec the second disc is titled um, native culture the new science and this one talks about the intu intuitive understanding of, of native cultures accessing their sacred cooperation community and education and native concepts of native conceptions of time, altered states of consciousness and navigation, internal imagery, forecasting and navigation, energy meditation, uh, which, which is great because she gives you a way to meditate um, um, in terms of um, um, building your energy or, or balancing your energy. Um, native ideas in practice, living in Indian time. So these are just this is just an example of what's uh, in w w within the the audio audio book i'll just uh, read the titles of the last three discs and i'll also have images up on screen so you can take a closer look at the titles that are in there holistic approaches to education uh, this is interesting so maybe i'll go a little bit into it the stresses of mod modern childhood which is interesting because with all the technology and the uh, high demand uh, to to excel in schools, children come under a lot of stress. So that's a good one to look through, to read through. Uh, guided meditation for children, highly needed in our society. Um, the telepathic powers of children. Hmm, you might want to listen to that one. That one's uh, really exciting. Um, so uh, session five or disc five um, relationship and quantum connection how our thoughts affect others and ourselves uh, life script practice journal so you learn to journal your life and come up with your life script totally interesting stuff the power of negative thoughts mm, that's a good one unconscious intentions mindfulness in daily daily life Communication through dreams and intuition. Now, when it comes to dreams, I have a bit of a problem with that. Um, whenever we uh, are here interpreting dreams and it's a blanket kind of like program where um, it doesn't specify which culture we're looking at. Of course, I understand at the base level, we all come from the same source. We all come from the same place. And therefore, there's a lot of... Um, uh, uh, commonality in terms of the imagery we might have but over time 
environment and um, society does play a part into it in shifting the the imagery we have internally and so when it comes to dreams i I'm, I'm a bit hesitant and reluctant to engage in somebody who says i can interpret your dreams when they're not from the same culture as you are or the same um background as you are because naturally our dreams feed off our environment and our nurturing her so but like i said the core of humanity it does have a lot of similarities so uh, to a point you could say uh, dream analysis can can be universal but i think um going deeper into it you you might want to consider the fact that people come from different um ethnic backgrounds and environments which affects our dreams the last session is uh it talks about the nature of time near-death experiences the evidence of reincarnation the power of re retro intention seeing the future changing cha and changing the past remote viewing of if of future events remote viewing practice cosmic consciousness and mystical pra experience uh, experience practices um, our human potential so in a nutshell I really love the research that went into this book and the audiobook and I also love the fact that it's um it's kind of like bridges the gap between the mystical and the scientific world the holistic world and the scientific world because what Lynn does is um she works with scientists she works with um holistic healers she works with cultures different cultures across the world and so it's really um a rich resource in terms of looking at humanity from a whole um not not holistic but um a gestalt perspective where you look at the whole um um uh, thing so would I recommend it? Yes, I'll definitely recommend it for research purposes and also for just broadening your scope in terms of um, uh, the language uh, uh, used in terms of uh, addressing the idea of energy and also just um, some perspective into experiences other people have had um, to do with energy. But what I love about it is how the psychological um, impact energy has on us without us realizing it so it comes highly recommended i will leave a link below where you can find it on amazon so do take a look at it do take take a peek into it also uh, search on youtube uh, about um the zero point field if you're interested in in energy so that's victor on the let me explain show and i just thought i would share what i'm listening to at the moment and um i hope i find you guys well all right, stay safe, stay happy, stay smiling, stay healthy.